Hey guys, it's Becca. Welcome to another vlog. I do want to say I know my face is really burnt right now. I was in the salt water for six hours. I am drinking water out of a wine glass, but I do not care. I just made dinner. Um, it's a rigatoni dish with some Parmesan cheese, mozzarella cheese, hot Italian sausage, vodka sauce, and lots of seasonings and some parsley on top. It looks so yummy, I cannot wait to try. It's like gonna fall onto the plate. <laughs> so it's a few minutes past nine and we had dinner a couple hours ago. We hung out, talked, we really want something cold but we've been trying to steer away from ice cream so i'm going to show you one of my favorite smoothies to make that we've been making all week we actually leave tomorrow on a trip to georgia we're driving to see my brother so we're trying to get rid of like a lot of the food that we bought which i think we've done a good job so far this is everything that i'm going to add in this smoothie and the only new thing today is the ginger root so when i worked at my old cafe we always did the liquid first so we knew how much smoothie we were basically making. So I'm gonna do about 16 ounces. And then I do all the frozen things at the bottom because those obviously are harder for the blender to blend. Do a little over a cup of sliced peaches. A little less than a cup of mango chunks. Pull the rest of the leaves off of here and finish this. So it's about that much kale and then I did throw in a banana. And then I also have some pineapple that I'm gonna throw in. I think I'm just gonna put the rest in honestly since, and then a little bit of juice. Now the last thing we have to add is some ginger. So I just got out of the shower and I'm uh, brushing my teeth and getting ready for bed. I'm gonna go ahead and put some of the whey leave-in conditioner in my roots. I was thinking about doing a full like nighttime skincare routine and I guess this classifies as that, except I barely put anything on my face. I don't put anything on it to clear it up. And if I do have a pimple or something, I just use the Mario Badescu buffering lotion on that one spot and it'll basically be gone. My face feels so swollen from the sun. So I'm gonna do some after sun, not too much though. So I usually put a little bit on and then I wait, honestly seconds, I was gonna say minutes, but it only takes seconds for my nose my like where i burn this area to soak it in so i kind of have to reapply until it's still like shiny i guess today i just did a little bit of brow pencil to see what it would look like if i potentially dyed them but i feel like i don't really need to because too much work <laughs> and this is definitely all for dry skin because I did get so much sun today because we had a private lesson at 2. Like I was out on the water from 9 to 12 and then teaching a lesson from 2 to 4 and then I was outside till 5 so that makes me want to cry. I just have to order some zinc for my face because sunscreen is just not doing it anymore. <laughs> oh, I don't even think I said I just put on the Intense Moisture Balance by Dermalogica and this is the travel size one because it was something that I got to try out and I'm really enjoying it so I think I'm gonna end up buying the larger size. Next I'm going in with the Laneige um, lip sleeping mask. Um, next I'm going to do a little bit of the Kiehl's 
powerful strength line reducing concentrate. I'm just gonna take a tiny bit and do have it like right here because the sun is I swear it's making my eyes wrinkle right here and I'm like just been noticing it in the past week so and I usually just use the excess right here because I do have like smile lines because the goal is to try to fix that naturally and not get anything done. Sometimes I'll roll my face out if I have some extra time, but it's already like 11. Right now I'm so tired and exhausted, so I'm gonna go to sleep, but I will see you tomorrow, so good night. Good morning. So it is Friday morning, I think around 8 a.m. I have a good friend who's about to come by to pick up um, a surfboard in the garage that needs to be fixed. Um, it's a long board, it's like 8-6. I'm literally wearing a Lululemon sports bra to work today. I'm really hoping the ocean does not ruin it, but at this point I don't really care because I'm waiting for my um, billabong one piece to come in the mail. But I'm gonna go ahead and head out and then I will update you guys as soon as I get home. So I was able to jump in the pool after being on the beach today and then I felt like I needed to just wash my hair and get clean before we're like stuck in the car and I'll probably just body shower by the time I get to my brother's and then after I eat I'm just gonna make a smoothie because I really am craving one and then I'm gonna go ahead and start to pack <laughs> These front pieces are getting so blonde. They're like turning into the same color as my eyebrows. It's crazy. I just went ahead and threw on the matching shirt to the shorts that I had on. I am wearing this set that is from Misguided. It's like this ribbed material. It's super thick and comfy, but it's not too thick to where I get too hot, so I wanted something pretty comfortable for the car ride. Okay, so behind me I have everything that I'm going to be bringing. So I'm going to go ahead and go through everything so that you can see what I take with me this weekend. So first I laid out just some jewelry that I think I'm going to bring and I don't need to bring my like real jewelry case. I'm just going to bring this little box that is from I believe a little Etsy small business. And then just some hoops, my watch, this for this white collar dress that is from Brandy Melville that I've had for forever. It's like a golf dress, but or it's like kind of like a polo dress, but it is super cute. We love like the all white. I grabbed my Levi jeans. I don't know what number these are, but they're the low pro straight jeans and they have like a rip in the knee on each side. Some socks. I grabbed my Aritzia Basic TNA tee with some white spandex for my dress and then a white bra for my dress. This is a short sleeve button up. It sort of looks like a towel and it kind of feels like a really soft towel, but the inside is super soft. This is from Misguided. I think they are so slept on, at least I think, because I never see, or at least anyone that I that I watch, I guess. They don't have anything from them, but they actually have some really good quality things. This suit is a suit that I picked up from a local place. It's super cute. It is one of those styles where the straps are connected to the front tie, so it just makes it super easy to wear. And then I just have my black sunglasses, my blue lights, and then I just grabbed a hat that I don't really care about because in case I lose it, <laughs> which I don't think I will, but just in case. Um, I grabbed two sets of PJs, a long sleeve t-shirt. I'm bringing my Lulu tank and like shorts, just in case we do anything active. I'm just bringing my everyday purse that I have, um, my small black notebook that I can use for taking notes on Sunday, 
and then brush my wax stick which i'll have to do like a look or a summertime hair makeup video or something using this because this stuff is amazing and is so good if you don't really like the way gel gel feels in your hair um love that it was literally four dollars on amazon so it's been amazing for me um makeup remover razor after sun of course because lord knows i will still be sunburned and this is like benadryl itch cream because i don't want to be bit by anything or get a bug bite and i cannot get the itch to go away that's like the my least favorite thing ever and then over here is just teeth care and some pads and q-tips for like removing makeup as far as sunscreen goes i'm just bringing both my sun bomb sprays and some face sunscreen over here i have my shower stuff my lip uh, Laneige lip mask. This is for washing my face and or doing makeup. In this bag I have all my babies, like all my little baby things that I love. And some SPF and face wash, my shower scrub. I use this for all my makeup so I really did not pack a lot because the only time I'll probably be doing my makeup is Sunday and I just know that I won't need it. So in my makeup bag I packed Laura Mercier, the little baby powder. I did like concealer right here. I did a kabuki brush for my blush and my powder. And then some lip colors and a brow pencil and eyelash curler and some mascara that I thought I stuck. Oh yeah, it's right here. So that's all I packed in there, so super simple. I still have to pack some pillows and sheets and blankets to throw in the car because I don't know if my eyes are too bright. <laughs> I don't know if my brother has anything for us, um, so I'd just rather be prepared. Um, over here, I'm gonna stick my laptop, iPad, phone charger, so much for watching this vlog and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!